Hello, Mrs. Sonia. The burlap sack design is ready. We just have to decide on the price. How much does it cost to make? Uh, one second. Uh, about three dollars. Hmm, three is a good number. Make it three thousand. Uh, but do you want to continue our charitable efforts? Of course. For every dress we sell, steal one from a person in need. But you do understand you're receiving so much backlash for that, right? <sighs> Make it two dresses, and we'll only steal from children. Only steal from children. And trust me, I've had to go through many hardships, just like you. But if you work hard, you too can be rich, just like me. Um, yeah, didn't your father give you a $150 million inheritance? Yes, but I had to work hard for my father's money. For instance, I had to be his son, and he was kind of a dick. Well, not to me, necessarily, but to the gardener. JK Rowling, how do you respond to people that call you a turf or a trans-exclusionary radical feminist for your transphobic tweets? Okay, so now I can't make a series of hurtful or damaging statements toward a group that's already experiencing disproportionately high rates of violence and suicide without being canceled? I mean, what is the world coming to? You could just apologize. Fine, all right, okay. I'm sorry that I am so absolutely correct all the time. I'm done with the interview now. Okay. Avada Kedavra, f*** off. Oh, Thank you. Expelliarmus, Which is why I am demanding the Senate pass universal health care. And by demand, I mean I am asking. And by asking, I mean I'm suggesting we think about it, but like not too seriously. You know, here's a thought. Let's keep healthcare private. And raise the price of all medicines, especially those for children. Yeah. Fuck them kids. Fuck them kids. Fuck them. Follow me on Twitter for more incoherent nonsense. <laughs> Thank you guys. Thank you. Thank you, Iowa. Hello everyone. I am Mark Zuckerberg. I am the genius who created Facebook. Yeah? The same guy who let Russia interfere with our election? Um, yeah. The same guy who allows false information to spread like it's a disease? Uh-huh. Oh, you have the same guy who's mining our data and using it for nefarious purposes? Well, that's true. For the guy who created a social media app, you're a pretty bad friend. Uh, well, actually, I did create it as a social media app. I originally intended it just to be a place where I could rate the women at my school based on their physical appearance. Ick. Ick. I think I'm gonna start an OnlyFans. Don't you think it's kind of wrong to invade a space occupied by sex workers, many of them women of color, and collecting money that might otherwise go to them while you don't face any of the backlash they have to endure? What? Nothing. What a fun idea. Thank you. I already got the setup account, but I think I'm gonna like take a fake nude or something and be like, hey, pay me $3,000 for a picture of my pinky toe. Uh, first, I brought you the Tesla engine. And then I brought you a truck that looks like a child tried to melt a toy with a magnifying glass. And now I bring you a microchip that allows your brain to sync up with a computer. Uh, yeah, um... This sounds like the government paid you to control us and you're trying to trick us into being your little robotic minions. Oh, no, no, no. That's not what I'm trying to do. It's what I've actually done. In fact, I've already implanted all of your brains with this microchip. Now, who is excited? I'm sorry, I forgot to press the thing. Now, who is excited? <laughs> Jeff Bezos, wake up! The ghost of Steve Jobs? What are you doing here? I'm here to warn you. Oh, I see what's going on. That there are gonna be three ghosts that visit me tonight to teach me the true meaning of Christmas? What? No. I'm here to warn you that when you die, you're going to hell just like me and there's nothing you could do about it. You're too far gone.
Sleep tight. <laughs> Alexa, purchase a controlling stake in hell and then kill this ghost. Siri, call me my ghost limousine right now. Alexa, cancel all limousines and purchase Tesla. I, I don't own Tesla. Hi, welcome to my home. We just did a total renovation where we removed all the floors and then I thought, I like floors. So then we added them back in. I love the walls because it goes all the way up to the ceiling. I collect very expensive ceramic pigs because they make me so happy and also so mad. And over here, this chair is very uncomfortable and it's haunted. I love it. I've never spent any time in this wing of the house because we just don't need the space, but it's good to know that we have it, even though we'll never need it. It just feels good to have more than you can ever possibly need. Over here is my dungeon. Just kidding, you thought I was crazy. <laughs> I'm not. Maybe you could live there. Just kidding. That'd be weird. I'm lonely. <laughs> so gross. Also, what's my ranking? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs>